Hello, my name is Rodney, and this year is going to be spring 2010. This is day one. It's not the best video camera, but my other one is dead right now. So let's see what we got so far. In my garage, I have seedlings going. These handy dandy Jiffy seedling starters. All kinds of goodies for the garden. I'll put the, be putting these in the ground starting in about two, three weeks. Up on the top shelf also. I have this seedling rack that I built. I only have one shelf on right now. And on it are tomatoes for the year. This is 16 varieties. Four plants each per variety. And those are what I'm most excited about. Let me step back here. Get a better look at my seedling rack. I have four levels. All four have lights on them. Fluorescent. They grow the plants pretty good, as you can see. These have been going about two, three weeks. On the side here, I have a strip where I can choose which level to use so I'm not just burning electricity. And I have that connected to a timer. Later, I might add heating pads to the bottom, which will help the germination and the plants grow faster. But since it's warming up, I probably won't need them this year. Okay, on to project number two. My second project this year, besides gardening, will be honeybees. Here you see, this isn't one hive, this is actually two. I just have them stacked in the garage after I built them. And I will be installing those, hopefully, outside tomorrow. I just have to get the area ready. Okay, I have a little bit of work to do in the garden. I go to school full time, so spring is a rush for me. I haven't hardly done any work outside. This is my garden shed. I know, it's fancy. Do you like my roof? AKA camper shell. Okay, over in this area that I still have to clean up, it's going to be where my honeybees are going to be. And back further over there, that's going to be my square foot gardening version 2.0. I know, it doesn't look like much now, but I've got big plans. This is my square foot garden area from last year. I'm going to redo the whole area, move boxes around, and start over. I have four boxes total in here. I'm going to reduce it to three, move one over to the other area, and just make more room over here. Some of the boxes are closer to the fence over there, which gives them too much shade. These were my tomato trellises last year, and I actually grew tomatoes all the way to the top. I had these grazed four by or two by two boxes, and they came with their own trellis. They didn't do too good last year, so I'm going to drop those down to the ground and just grow squash and cucumbers out of them over in the new area. Okay, well, I've got some work to do out here for now, and I will 
stop this and get busy with this.